Welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be taking a look at the top 7 most iconic cruiser motorcycles of all time. Number 7. Kawasaki Vulcan 900 The Kawasaki Vulcan 900 Classic, introduced in 2006, is like that cool mid-sized cruiser in town. It's got the looks. Think Harley Davidson Softail Deluxe or Fat Boy vibes. Under the seat, you've got a 903cc V-twin engine with a 5-speed transmission. That's the good stuff. It's not a giant on the streets. It measures 97 inches in length, has a 64.8-inch wheelbase, and a comfy seat 26.8 inches off the ground. Oh, and it carries around a massive 5.3-gallon tank, the biggest in its class. Fancy features like floorboards, front and rear disc brakes, electronic fuel ejection, and a belt drive for the final touch. The Vulcan 900 isn't just about power. It's got style. With its timeless design, comfy bucket seat, and a rear that's wider than your average grin. Plus, that low seat height makes it a breeze for riders of all sizes. This bike's got presence. It's like the quiet guy who surprises everyone with their hidden talents. The classic stance, rich paint, and stylish spoke wheels are here to stay, just like your favorite classic tunes. In 2023, the Kawasaki Vulcan 900 hasn't lost its charm. With easy-to-red tank-mounted instruments and the beefy 903 CC V-twin engine, it's still making a statement. Number 6. Triumph Rocket 3R The Triumph Rocket 3R, a beast of a bike crafted by the folks at Triumph Motorcycles Limited. But it's not just any Rocket 3, it's part of a trio, with its buddies being the Touring Focus GT and the exclusive TFC. Now let's talk engine. A water-cooled 2458 CC three-cylinder powerhouse churning out a whopping 165 horsepower and 221 newton meter of torque. It's got a wet clutch, a six-speed manual transmission, and a shaft drive to keep things running smoothly. The Rocket 3R isn't just about muscle. It's got style too. Picture a muscular 18-liter fuel tank with a cool central recess, a brushed tank strap, and a snazzy Monza-style cap. It rocks intricate 20-spoke wheels, comfy adjustable ergonomics, and a nifty torque-assist hydraulic clutch. For a smooth ride, you've got Showa front forks and a Showa piggyback reservoir rear suspension with remote hydraulic preload adjustment. So, in a nutshell, the Triumph Rocket 3R is not just a powerful cruiser. It's a stylish, tech-savvy, and comfortable ride that's up for the long haul. Number 5. Harley-Davidson Sportster S the Harley-Davidson Sportster S, the cool cat of cruiser motorcycles that made its grand entrance in 2021. Sporting the chunky, in-your-face look, this bike means business. The fat front tire leads the charge, and the high-mount shotgun exhaust screams, I'm here to party. The tail section takes a cue from Harley's dirt track legends, and the controls are so simple, even your grandma could use them. This bad boy is packing a liquid-cooled Revolution Max 1250 TV twin engine, dishing out a whopping 121 horsepower and 94 pound-feet of torque. With double overhead camshafts and variable valve timing, it's got that torque you crave and a power band that's quicker than your cat when you shake the treat bag. In fact, it's lighter than your average featherweight boxer, tipping the scales at just 502 pounds with a full tank. In the battle of the cruiser titans, the Sportster S goes toe-to-toe -to -toe with the BMW R9, the Triumph Bonneville Bobber, and the Indian Scout. If that's not enough, rumor has it there are more variations of this beast in the works, so stay tuned for what's next. Number 4. Indian Scout Bobber The Indian Scout Bobber, my friends, is like that cool, mysterious character in a blacked-out movie scene. It's got that classic bobber style and a minimalist design that's as straightforward as your grandma's apple pie recipe. The front fender is shorter than your patience in a traffic jam, matching the rear like they were meant to be. And those engine heads, they're chromed out, adding the touch of bling to the party, while the dual exhaust pipes give off a vibe that says, I mean business. Under the seat, you've got a liquid-cooled, 100-horsepower V-twin engine that's got more kick than a mule with a grudge, easily handling the bobber's weight of 544 pounds. It shifts gears with a six-speed transmission and a final drive belt, smooth and snappy. The suspension isn't shy either, with 4.7 inches of telescopic fork travel and 2 inches of dual shocks travel. Now, as you hit the road, heads will turn, 
and the Scout Bobber's price tag isn't too shabby at $11,500. The mirrors might have you craning your neck in awkward position, but that's a quick fix. And as for long rides, well, let's just say it's not the comfiest sofa on wheels. To wrap it up, the Indian Scout Bobber is a bike that loses classic bobber style with a dash of minimalism. Number 3. Ducati X Diavel The Ducati X Diavel, the bike that's got the best of both worlds, it's like the James Bond of motorcycles, blending the laid-back vibes of a cruiser with the heart-pounding excitement of a Ducati. You've got three flavors to choose from, X Diavel Nera, X Diavel S, and X Diavel Dark. Each has its own unique personality. And let's not forget the X Diavel's bold design. It's a head-turner, for sure. Those shoulders and those four exit exhaust pipes make sure you're never lost in the crowd. Under the seat, You've got the twin-cylinder Testastretta DVT-1262 engine, the real star of the show. It's the engine that makes everything tick. The power, the character, and the style. But it's not just about what's inside. The x has got the moves too. With its top-notch chassis, suspension, brakes, and fancy electronics, it's all about the perfect combo of comfort and performance. With two colors and two variants to choose from, you got options. So there you have it, the Ducati XDL, where cruiser cool meets Italian speed, and it's a match made in motorcycle heaven. Number 2. Honda Shadow Phantom The Honda Shadow Phantom, the cool cat of cruiser motorcycles that's been rolling since 1983. It's got a V-twin engine that's more chilled out than your favorite iced coffee. Looks-wise, the Shadow Phantom is sleek and sly with a handlebar that's got some swagger. It sits low, feels stable, and boasts a seat height that's totally approachable. The 2023 Shadow Phantom packs a 745cc liquid-cooled V-twin engine with enough valves to keep things interesting. When it comes to getting that engine purring, the Phantom doesn't mess around. It's got programmed fuel injection with automatic enrichment, as if it's treating itself to a fine dining experience. The ignition is digital with 3D mapping. No, it won't take you to another dimension, but it will give you smooth power. Starting this bad boy is as easy as flipping a light switch, thanks to the electric starter. The transmission is a 5-speed wonder with a multiplate wet clutch, smooth as butter. For the suspension, you've got a telescopic fork up front and dual shocks in the back. Plus, you can tweak the rear springs five ways to Sunday. And for those penny-pinching folks, you can grab the 2024 model at a base price of $8,400 or go all in with the ABS version for $8,700. Number 1. Harley-Davidson Fatboy The Harley-Davidson Fatboy, folks, is no ordinary bike. It's a V-twin softail cruiser with some solid cast disc wheels to keep things rolling smoothly. Back in 88 and 89, Harley's legends Willie G. Davidson and Louis Nets cooked up this bad boy, and they even whipped up a prototype for the Daytona Bike Week rally in Daytona Beach. This bike's got star power too. You've seen it in TV shows and movies. Remember Terminator 2? The fat boy stole the show there. This bike's got a brawny look with its wide stance, unique style, and a punchy engine to boot. The seat's split and it's got a ground clearance of 115 mm, just enough to clear those bumps. Classic is the name of the game with the fat boy, full disc aluminum wheels, that cool teardrop shaped fuel tank, and a rear fender with a touch of copper style class. Under the seat, the fat boy packs a Milwaukee 8114 engine, lots of torque for when you need it, and that unmistakable HD growl. Fuel-wise, you're looking at 19 liters in the tank and about 18 km per liter if you're keeping it frugal. And here's the cherry on top. The fat boy is all about the ride. It's comfy as can be, no matter how far you're cruising. Yeah, it's an investment. But for all you Harley diehards, it's worth every penny. And with this, we have reached the end of this video. If you found it helpful, then make sure to like it and subscribe the channel for future upcoming videos.